Consider the data shown on the screen. How can we calculate the average deviation? The average deviation, here's the formula. I'm going to use AD to represent it. It's the sum of each data point minus the mean divided by n. So first, we need to calculate the mean. The mean is going to be, it's the sum of all of the x values over n. So we have 8 plus 12 plus 15 plus 18 plus 19 plus 23 plus 31. And we're going to divide all of this by 7. n is 7 since we have 7 numbers. 8 plus 12 is 20, plus 15, that's 35, plus 18, that's 53, plus 19 is 72, plus 23 is 95, plus 31, that's a total of 126. So that's the sum of the seven numbers. Now we're going to take the sum of those numbers divided by the number of numbers that we have. So that's 7, and we get 18. So now we have x bar, the arithmetic mean. So now we can calculate the average deviation. So we're going to take each number and subtract it from the mean. So we're going to have 8 minus 18 and then 12 minus 18. I'm going to run out of space, so we're going to have to do this mentally. So taking the first number, subtracting it by the mean, 8 minus 18 is negative 10. Notice that we don't have the absolute value symbol here. This is not the mean absolute deviation. So we need to incorporate the negative numbers. Next, 12 minus 18 is negative 6. 15 minus 18 is negative 3. And then 18 minus 18 is 0. 19 minus 18 is 1. 23 minus 18 is 5. 31 minus 18, that's going to be 13. And we're going to divide that by 7. So notice that negative 6 cancels with 1 and 5. 1 plus 5 is 6, and negative 6, they cancel. Negative 10 and negative 3, that's negative 13. It cancels with 13. So this turns out to be 0. So that is the average deviation of this particular data set.